Yo, he legit looks completely different. He no? looks older. Right? He looks like a man. He looks like a man. Wow! Hey, check out our Patreon in the link below. You'll have access to uncut and upcoming reactions, skits, behind the scenes footage, and so much more. Your support goes a long way to helping us with more reactions and original content. Also, thanks for subbing. Set, Set the, the bell, bell for notifications. notifications. Your boy Rock Lee. Shoulder. Hey, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do so. Parasite reaction starting now. Yo, what's going on, guys? Your boy Rock Lee. Nerd. You're nasty. Jumping into our Parasite reaction. Uh, quick recaps on the uh, on the last episode. Uh, piggybacking off of Adorkable's uh, observation, these these women got some serious intuition in this episode. Between the parasites and just regular women, because it always shows a, a girl noticing the changes in Izumi not being human. So I wonder As where they're going to go with it. As of now. We've also noticed that the par I, I picked this up early on, I forgot about it, but the girl parasites, at least so far, seem to be the more logical, sane ones. As opposed to the guys who get like over emotional and they just want to kill, like why do they you just do something. Why do you say that though? What about the? Because we saw the, the 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 teacher parasite. Yeah, she stayed with her job. She did what she had to do. That one other parasite was living life like she was supposed to before she got in a car accident. And she took over that guy's life, and the guy one, at least the guy parasites we've seen. Like in the first episode in this one, like they've all been in a killing spree where like they just start killing random people, they changing their face, they don't do anything. The girl parasites, at least the ones that take over the girls, they seem more like stable. Like, okay, I can live off of this as long as I, I claim this territory. I know, and I, hmm? I know the random answer. Yo, it's scientific, it's biological. So you know how women's chromosomes is XX, men is XY? Because men are lacking that little extra chromosome, I think that could be why the women have like the perception or why when they're parasites, they're a little more, a little less irrational or a little more willing to stay within the means of what they're doing. Maybe that little extra part of the chromosome has something special that affects the brain that the women can see when like the men parasites have issues that the men won't be able to pick up on. That's the only thing scientifically so far. They keep bringing up this theme that it's the women that recognize something's wrong with men parasites. So I'm like biologically, chemically, parasitically, what could it be? Well, it well women be recognize, I, I don't know that part when it, I went far extreme. You said women recognize male parasites. Parasites just recognize all the parasites. Paras no, but yeah. the women recognize regular women recognize something wrong with other parasites. Well, or the regular women re okay. realize that Uzumi is off, and they don't off, know why. Yeah. As as far as we, as far as we know, it's it's that kind of connection. But going up Uzumi, but go, like, if we're if we're going to entertain, okay, I, I see where you're going with the science part. Yeah. So I, can, I think I can combine it. If we're going with the theory that the male parasites tend to be more sporadic than the mm -hmm. females. It could be- I think it's testosterone. It what? Testosterone. They literally just have more energy like that. So they're like, they get angry faster and they don't know how to deal with emotions like that because parasites are supposed to be logical. But for them, it's like they run off of, for at least guys, oddly enough, they're the ones who run off the feelings and the girls are the ones who kind of like hesitate, think about it, overanalyze. Which kind of makes sense and is kind of weird at the same time. Yeah, the guys, for the for all the Give purposes, it to the primitive side. Yeah, the front hunter line. gatherers going out there to fight, you know, <laughs> collect food, whatever, and come back. Where the females, biologically, is, I'm not labeling, but you know, for the most part, have been historically nurturers, thinkers. And if you're taking over that body and acquiring the characteristics, that would be what you fall in line with. Again, it could be early on though, but like the characteristics, it could be the people that the parasites have chosen because the guys themselves don't seem sane anyways. And the girls seem pretty much like educated for the parasites. That's what I was, yeah. I, I think I said that too. I think it has something to do with that chromosome. That's why I'm, I'm put it right on there. But the chromosome goes right along with what you're saying. Maybe it's testosterone, maybe it's estrogen, but whatever it is, there's a specific reason why regular and parasitic women can see things in a male parasite that nobody else is seeing. That's the, the best part. way I could see. Yeah, it. for the most part. Because I did make I did make a bad generalization earlier. But yeah, yeah, but now it's fixed. Yes. The girl, like even that one random girl, Morocco. That's the next point I was gonna just say. She literally stared at him, mm -hmm. and then she like saw an eye pop out. I don't know if she saw the eye. But the bloodshot eye, something. and you see the little red spores they keep showing. That's like the third time they showed that when when a female looked at him and he looked at his eye, it goes bloodshot, and then you see like a blackness and little red spores. And then another eye. And oh, and then the, I thought that was the same eye they were showing. 
Well, yeah, right. I'm like, well, yes. I'm like, it doesn't really matter. But the, it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. But the point is, I they think know. It's another eye. I think that's like him, like getting, like, because they're connected. So his brain could be changing psychologically. And so, like, for him, it's like it'll be obvious in the eyes. So for girls, at least, it's because they're they're so easy. Because I actually have the answer. Me, what is it? What? It's the it's the waves. It's wavelengths. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. what I was about to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said it yeah. like that girl. He's like she's very perceptive, but that girl Murano. Or girl Morano's perceptive, however, the other, other girl, girl is on like, another level. She's on another level. She can transfer like the wavelengths of yeah. the air size. Yeah, she can so, read the same wavelengths. Yeah. And as far as we know, it's only the girls who can do this. Yeah. The guys haven't noticed anything. I think the eye is a figurative thing. You that are physically looking into the eyes. Mm -hmm. It's a combination of the eyes and this wavelength that's happening. And apparently girls are just more in entwined with wavelengths. They're intuitive. Intuitive with wavelengths. And then there's a, there's one in particular that's like, whoa, she really got it. Um, to the point where she was like. The warriors ones, the ones who figure out like who's who and they have to kill them before, you know? Ooh. I'm thinking about what I said. Ones. It's because of the X chromosome. I'm giving the credit to the X no, chromosome. No, I like, bro. I like her theory though. In general, be the like, fighters. Worst, she's gonna be the fighter. She's yeah, gonna be the fighter. you're the one who can detect them. You gotta go out there and fight them. She's gonna be like, oh, or at least at least point them out. Yeah, that, that person's out. not point that person's not uh, human. Mm -hmm. Then you have a little task force. Yeah, got the Yo, and then the fighters would be you, the guys. Yeah, you contact see, tracing. The contact tracing. Wow. <laughs> you can't get rid of the detector because then you never. She know She said the guys are expendable ones. She's actually Cause, right. Because honestly, she is. But it still hurts. I don't want to say expendable, but yeah, the ones that have the. She's right. From a tactical point of view, now I'm thinking like these parasites. Still yeah, you have the ones that do the detect, recon, and then y'all go fight. Or at least confirm. There's, yeah, you're honest some stuff. It still hurts. Anyway. I don't know if a war's gonna happen though, but. We're gonna jump into it, guys. If you guys aren't subscribed, now's a good time to do so. Full reaction, full discussion will be on our Patreon. Also, hit the bell for notifications. Woo! We post content daily on YouTube. You don't wanna miss out. All right, let's jump into parasites starting now. That's guilt. He did that on purpose. He he got broken by the situation and by the guilt, man. That's why he let her stab him. Funny thing is, not funny funny, but now if we talk about the observation of it all, like, this is a big deal that he got stabbed or whatever, and we went to every other point. It's a it's a big deal. It's just he, funny. He's the MC. Like I guess is he we know he's gonna be alright. I think it yeah. wasn't impactful to us because we're yeah. like, yo, it's episode. Five, six, or seven. Oh, yeah, something like that. Yeah, during one session, like, yeah, we skipped over. I'm like, that's not important. Yeah. It really isn't. No, it's not. He's an MC. Like, yeah. and then it didn't look like a fatal blow. So, like, yeah, it went straight to the heart. Yeah, it looks like a fatal. It chest. looks like a fatal. The heart's here. Yeah, bro. Like the middle of your ribs. He yeah, went. Right, right, I'm pretty sure the heart is more towards the center than and anything. I, they it's know where the, the fatal hits are. Like, not I don't all think of it's them. Gonna... Not, remember, not all of them. Truth. But that parasite probably does. I think this Yo, one that does. Hit, that hit was too high and too high to the left. Hit him like right there. It's not his heart. Because as soon as it pulled out, you would have seen the quick, 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 quick. It was a slow bleed. Did it pull out? It did pull, it did out. pull out. Like prom night. That's what she's. Okay. Say like page. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is it like prom yeah. night? Like yeah. prom night, yeah. Yeah, pull out. Listen, I was gonna say, well, not you, but it is. It, <laughs> hey, no seatbelts. Oh, man. Yeah, see, it's a slow bleed. That's the chest. That's the heart. No, it's. Oh. Recruit cells. Grant. Oh, so he's not gonna stay as the heart. He's gonna get as much of him back to the hand as possible. Okay. But he'll be like, if he's going through the bloodstream, he's gonna go all over. That's what I was thinking. 
Ch -ch 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 -ch. Damn, who do you like better? Her. Who do I like more? Yeah. The uh, red hairish one. That's the easy choice. Yeah. The one with the glasses is thicker though. <laughs> How long do you think it's been? Yeah, where's the mom? Oh, oh. Mom? No, I meant the mom parasite. Oh, she thought he was dead. She's like, oh, you're gonna die. There's zero percent chance. Did he just drink water? Drinking well, water for water. him. And sugar? Sugar water. Nutrients. Yep. Oh, his hand. Mickey's it's, it's done. Yeah. Sorry, fam. I'm on that Peter Parker tip. I knew it. We were dead on. Maggie went through the bloodstream and fixed too much. Is that a way to say that? Mm. Fixed too much? How can you fix too much? Overheal? Like, he just fixed a bunch of things in his body. He probably, yeah, he probably fixed his, like, eyesight and stuff. Damn! He it's not ripped. perfect, but she's... You think he looks ripped? I just think he looks oh, slender. He looks no, yeah. yeah, he's just skinny. Don't get twisted. Miggy heal Miggy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> right? You're done for the count. Oh. This is what I was waiting for. His back looks really bad. A dream. It wasn't a dream. I, I was worried when he woke up and saw the blood, it'd be an instant like snap again, but it took him a minute. Dad made it. Dad made it. <laughs> See, he looked kind of sick. He looked like the. Oh, yeah, for sure. They were teaching him. Oh, poor girl. Oh, he's about to tell you to go away. Oh, okay. No, he nodded. It's good. He managed like the tiniest smile. Ooh. Oh. Oh. I'm I'm happy. Now he's he finally got it. He's where he needs to be. Why would you ask him that? Oh girls. Yo, he legit looks completely different. He no? looks older. Right? He looks like a man. He looks like a man. He doesn't have the chubbiness anymore. It's like very. It's not smooth chiseled. anymore. Yeah, chiseled, long. Jeez, maybe he just upgraded him pretty much. Legitimately. <laughs> Oh my god. They're gonna paint him as crazy. <laughs> nah. Just tell him a parasite took over her head. He doesn't know what took over I know. Her head. I'm actually, this is crazy. I'm really glad his dad knows. It figured in. Yo, no. Come on, no, 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 no. Come on, Dad. Mm -mm. It's no. supposed to be both of y'all together. Yes. You no! saw it! Tell him that you saw it! No, no, no. Come yeah. on. You gotta tell now, me. Now, Izumi's figuring out what's going on. 
You have to show him though. Nah, 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 I wouldn't show him. Yes, tag team. Dad and father gonna go kill mama together. That ain't mom no more, son. That sounds gangster, but nah. That's what I wanted to happen, that's me. Cause the dad was talking real gangster on the phone. Come on, bro. Okay, that's fine. He lost his wife too. You're right. I don't think he wants the son to buy into his crazy. Mm -hmm. That's because the dad doesn't know that. And he doesn't know that Shinji got attacked either. So he's putting up this front. They're lying to each other. Miggy hasn't talked this whole time. Okay. I mean, I said tag team with dad, take out mom. <laughs> That's what I thought was about to happen. That's what I wanted to happen. You always gotta have somebody on your side. This is the same girl? Sa yeah. I mean, he just had like major heart surgery. That's true, though. Awesome. You can hear pretty far. Maybe you fix too much, fam. She's got like superpowers. Ray's gonna start sniffing people like Wolverine. <laughs> That's how a baby would be, basically. Not yes. Like the baby. This would be like the advancement. <laughs> Damn, that's a big problem. Yeah, the facts. He doesn't know how. Yo, Mickey really processed it, like. Yo. <laughs> yeah, that's director's point. Miggy saved Miggy. <laughs> yeah. Simple. Oh, he's back now. Like his his yeah. life in his face. That's <laughs> every girl. That girl looked young for him. No, she can't keep up. She's already no, tired. Oh, shoddy. Look at the speed. He's really fast. I wonder if he's noticed yet. He probably has the sight of hearing. Homie is real Yeah, family. that is crazy. That's what I was like. Cause she was warned the sea wall is there. You can't cross over. Oh, it's not her. Is it? I look like a dude. Right? Okay. You're stronger. He's in a blind rage. The thing is, it's like he doesn't even know his body can handle this until now. You know what I'm saying? He doesn't realize it. He doesn't know how fast he is. He doesn't even recognize it. He just diverted 12 foot seawall. Like he's just, he's just like, yeah, nah, I'm killing who killed my mama. But no, what I'm trying to say is like, I'm not jumping from the seawall like down there because I would already be operating like that's a fault. It's like he has a new body and he always knew that he could just make that epic leap and not be hurt. That's what I'm trying to say. Like. I'm with you. He's, he doesn't even notice. That's I'm like, you're like, he's in a blind rage. I'm like, yeah, it's as simple as that. He's dealing with grief, revenge, anger. He he does not even comprehend how fast he made to that seawall. He can't comprehend that he just verted 12 feet. But what made him even think to make that leap? 
So, okay, so so what I'm thinking is he already knew like Migi transformed things in him because he was saying he, oh, he fixed my hearing, he fixed my eyesight. Then he got, he got notified of like her being like 300 meters away and he was yeah. just like, all right, I'm going. So he booked it. He's just thinking about, I have to kill her. Naturally, his brain is saying, we have to get over this wall quickly. Like, it's not really like he's it's thinking primal. It's just, it's primal. He's missing that X. He got the Y chromosome. It's primal, bro. That's how guys are. If it was a girl, <laughs> well, she would have hesitated. She would have been like, I have to, think, you know? I'm all right with you. It's just when you say that's how guys are, but I don't know if she took a jab or not, but yeah. Guys just do things without thinking, and it usually just works out. Like, he's just like, boys. jumps, he jumps. That's boys kind do of things it. without boys, thinking. Boys, boys, boys. Men yeah. plot, plan, and execute. That's, He's that's right. true, that's true. He's right. At some point in life, you're compulsive and you just go out and you do. And then things happen because it doesn't always work out. <laughs> then things happen, you're like, wait a second, I gotta start thinking things through. <laughs> I know guys when they're like 13, they would like go on the, you remember those tables we used to have in my neighborhood? Yes. The, the picnic tables? Yeah. They would just like, they'd be like, do a flip. And they would just like, okay. And they would just do a flip. Yeah. And it would usually work out well for them. Because like, it's just, to it's be just young like, again. To be young again. They didn't even think about it. That's how it was for him. He was just like, yeah, jump, jumps. That's it. That's that's probably what it is. It's Simple. just Simple. Yeah, that, hey, primal. That, that wild crow. Testosterone. <laughs> he's primal. Testosterone is going. Has all these abilities. I'm just gonna jump this thing straight up. That's crazy, man. It wouldn't even bother. Me. It wouldn't even surprise me if there's also some instinctual elements at this moment because the parasites are instinct instinctual. So he just might have some instincts now. What? You remember earlier when uh, Purple Hero later talking about, oh, I got one, I was told one thing when I inherited this body, devour, right? Cannibalism, right? Right now, he's like, hey, he's part, he's part Mickey now. He got that, he's like, yo, I got devour. Yeah. That's probably, yeah. Yeah. His, his directives. His I'm directive just... is, I got, I got to kill. Yeah. That's the homie that killed my mom. Or is my, I gotta kill my mom, however he says it. He's probably gonna just start killing all the- Parasites, the yeah. That's what I gathered, because if it's a natural instinct to cannibalize whatever you take over, if it's inverse that Iggy took him over, that he took Iggy over, it's Iggy's instinct is to devour. Izzy's instinct is to, Miggy and Izzy, what? yeah. I know I what you're saying. I messed yeah. him up, I see but I knew we were going, I knew you were going. He's not devoured other parasites, man, that's it. That's all I gotta say. Forget the names, they gonna devour, that's it. Simple. Ah, uh, back to the thing with the dad, though. I got out of it, so they're both operating from information that the other person doesn't have. Dad was convinced this was a monster. Then, he, the, the police or the, the detectives show up. I assume they're detectives. Psychologists, detectives, doctor. They show them all the evidence. Like, yo, the mark on the hand, the camera, yo, she is there. Now homie's questioning himself. I don't know if he saw the monster resume the form of his wife. So. He just saw the monster kill his wife. He so, saw the monster cut off her head. And for him, that was like- Mom is gone. Mom's gone. So for seeing mom and they're, they're proving it, now he's calling himself in question. Had he saw her actually transform into mom, his argument would have been automatically, yeah, it's, well, he did say an imposter. He said it was a monster. He didn't no, say a monster. he said imposter. No, he no, did say imposter. He, As I ran oh, scene yeah, back. Yeah, yeah, dad absolutely knows what happened. He does. The only thing I can say is out of self-preservation, while he was being pushed by doctors and detectives and psychologists, he's like, you know what? It's better if I just drop it right now. I got a son I gotta think about, I'ma drop it, I'ma wait. Cause like, Izzy yelled at him. He's like, nah, bro, we both know what's going on. And the dad was like, listen, bro, not right now. That's why he broke his like crying. Izzy doesn't know about how the dad just had to deal with just, the detectives. Yeah, he don't know that. He if don't he, know that. Yeah. And dad don't know that Izzy just got murdered by mom. The moment they put those stories together, that's why I was like, yo, it's gonna be dad dad and son duo. We gotta fuck mom up, son. We got to. If I was Izzy, I wouldn't want my dad involved. What is his dad gonna do? He can't do anything. I wouldn't want dad involved. But at least he's not alone. All right. If dad did not do anything, but when, when does like dad, you're not crazy. No, what you saw is real. And dad's like, yo, you're not crazy. Like think, what's happening to you isn't crazy. As long as it's on our side, fine. Then and what? it's like, at least you have somebody. Like dad could plot, dad could be bait. Dad could, I don't know. I don't know about that. I just feel I like you lost mom. You don't gotta lose dad too. Cause I thought he was gonna be an orphan. 
That would There's a lot of complicated things run at the same time. Very and much so. Izzy, if I had to assume, Izzy is like, you know what? It's better for dad to be in denial, not know this is, ex exists, and now he's out of the fight. That's what they're both trying to do with each other. That's why I said I want them to talk. They're trying to do it to each other. He's like, nah, I'm not going to bring the kid into this. I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to say I didn't know what's going on. I'm going to figure it out on my own. Yeah. And Izzy's like, all right, I'm going to protect dad. I'm gonna make sure he don't know nothing. He don't want to admit it. That's fine. It's better that he doesn't know. I'm gonna figure this out. The best. There's three scenarios. The, well, there could be more, but there's three scenarios. Izzy, Izzy does the fighting by himself. Dad does the fighting by himself. Or they both are, you know, together. I almost feel, and I this is an opinion. There's more to. There's more problems that can occur if Dad's in on this plan. Because once Dad is in on this plan. It's gonna, it's gonna have to be his way because he's the father. And no matter what Izzy says, it's gonna be like, you know, you can't do this. I gotta do it this way, whatever, whatever. So of these three plans, the best plan with everything that's on the table is for Izzy just to take this on his own, right? He has Miggy, keep dad out of it because dad is a liability if he enters a battlefield. And dad might wanna enter a battlefield because no dad is gonna be like, all right, son, I'm gonna let you handle it and I'm gonna sit back and I'm gonna trust this Miggy thing to do the automatic defense for you. It's in Izzy's best. If Izzy wants to get this taken care of, keep his dad. It's better to keep his dad out the way, safe, and he takes care of the threat himself. And now he's enhanced. Well, I'm just saying, Dad could be informed and out the way. If Dad's informed, Maybe he's gonna he's want to be in the way. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Anime dads. Okay, so I think. And real dads. I think um, because of how he was describing everything, he knew that she like. I think because they he was injured when he called. First of all. Um, his son. He got stabbed. He got he got stabbed. He got slashed and stuff. And he wasn't wet. He didn't fall in the ocean. Oh. So he ran. He just booked it. He ran away from. Him. So that thing attacked him, after merging with the mother, most likely. So he saw that. But what we saw from what he saw was just the the head cut off. So I'm thinking this is like just trauma. His brain is like it's too much for him. True. So he's pretending that didn't happen. And as the investigators keep talking and giving him information, his brain is trying to help him stay like alive on survival mode because if not, he might lose it. So that's what your brain naturally does. So what he's doing is like putting up um, walls to pretend like that memory did not happen. That was fake. That was all a lie. So when he, his son came in and said that, he was just like, no, you're lying. You're lying to me. He was actually trying to believe that lie that he made for himself so he would stay sane. Mm, so insightful. So when, Maybe. so when his son is gonna go fight the mom, I don't think he's gonna know anything about it. As far as he knows, his his wife is like injured or she got an accident, she died. He's not gonna question it or even look into it just cause like, just even a memory of her will like spark like a, that, that it's trauma. easier for him not to think about it. So once I think he's gonna start picking up his son is kind of acting odd and do stuff, but he's gonna probably ignore it. Just because he knows something's up, but he's like not gonna even Jeez. in a way he's gonna subconsciously know his son is also part of that little thing that's going on. And he's just gonna kinda let it be crazy. Yeah, I think she's spinning because this it's whole thing is wrong, the yeah. whole thing is crazy. So if I went through this and y'all told me, you're crazy, that never happened, we just saw the wife. I'd have to start being like, am I? Yeah, yeah. There's whole teams of people on medicine because they, they legitimately believe they, they see things and they're not there. Yeah, Whole true. teams. So true, we'll see. True, true. Anyways guys, thanks for riding with us on our Parasite Reaction. If you're not subscribed, now's a good time to do so. Full reaction, full discussion will be on our Patreon. Also, hit the bell for notifications. We post content daily and you don't want to miss it. All right, uh, until next time, I'm your boy, Rock Lee. I'm our fool nerd. Direct Nasty, out. <laughs> wait, 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 I'm gonna laugh. Okay. If you haven't already, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell for notifications, and check out our Patreon for full and upcoming reactions. Wow.